We're getting an Indian takeaway. Oh, it smells so good. Another week of filming 100 princess videos. Oh, I'm so proud. The last couple of days have been weird. Oh, my Lord. We're putting new shoes on and I just stood in a puddle. shopping today which you will have seen um i filmed a little bit but it was on my phone we originally had a restaurant booked for tonight and then i was just kind of like bilbo's not been left on his own for quite a while during lockdown so i was a little bit worried about that and we were just like oh is it worth the effort so we decided that we'd get a takeaway instead but that we'd still have like a full-on date night so that is why i'm all dressed up in a little dress and um Mike looks stunning as you can imagine so uh yeah we, we're getting an Indian takeaway today when we went shopping I can't tell you what I was going shopping for I mean we were kind of just mooching around anyway but I got my mum some bits for her birthday that's about it really I've not worn a red lip in ages hope it's not on my teeth we've just done our usual photo shoot before why are you so small <laughs> before oh, we this We've just done our photo shoot before we, um, I was going to say go it's out, but we're not even going out. Yeah, we do a photo shoot, don't we? We do. You always say we never get any nice pictures of us and we don't, to be fair. Yeah, we don't really get any nice pictures, so good idea. Good on you. Good on you. I should mention that we've watched Hamilton three times already and we're obsessed. Let me know if you've watched Hamilton and what you think of it. everyone it's a new day and um we're going for some lunch sunday lunch we've had lunch now i didn't film anything because um it was kind of it wasn't like busy but there was people around and it was quite a peaceful and quiet environment again it was really well managed yeah we both had a sunday lunch and now we are just walking to uh my nana's so with it being nice weather we're gonna pay them a visit and um just sit in the garden i think i am about to put on a wax melt and my best friend actually sent me these as a surprise and i just had a little look at um the fragrances and then i thought oh no i should film this so this was a total surprise in the mail so this is the company if you would like to get yourself some wax melts i believe that these are like perfumes because the first thing that i saw was this one. Um, one of my favourite perfumes in the world is Jo Malone Pomegranate Noir and this is that scent so I'm going to light these in a second and look how cute they are. They've got glitter in them. This one is English Pear and Freesia so that is um, exciting because I bet that one smells deliciously fresh. Oh she knows me so well. This one is called Aliens and I'm hoping that it smells like the perfume Alien. This one is Lime Basil and Mandarin and this is also a Jo Malone fragrance. Jo Malone used to be um, kind of expensive anyway but now the prices have really gone up so this is really exciting. Excuse the appearance today. I am just doing a house tidying day, so I'm not getting dressed up for anything. Let's have a smell. I kind of want to smell them all. Right. Oh. Okay, that smells super duper strong of, of um, Jo Malone. I'm very excited about that. I'm going to smell the others. I'm too excited. Oh, it smells so good, actually. That one might be... Oh, that one might be my favourite of the two. Right, let's smell. I'm leaving Alien till last because I love it so much. Um, let's smell English Pear and Freesia. Oh, as I thought, that smells so fresh. I think my favourite is still Lime Basil and Mandarin up to now. I'm excited about this one because I love this perfume and I haven't worn it in so long. Yes. They're all so, so nice. I think I am going to light. Oh, it's between Pomegranate Noir and 
lime basil and mandarin? Oh, I don't know. It's cute. I'm excited to come back in about half an hour and see what it smells like. I'm just sorting out wedding stuff and this is our, I've got our wedding box here with all our stuff in it that we've bought so far. And I've got like wedding party gifts in it and um, confetti. I've got favors, like wedding um, favors. I've got my dad's gifts for the wedding complete. I've got half of my mum's gift. I've got the bridesmaid's earrings. It's so exciting. So yeah, I'm kind of keeping everything in this ginormous box at the moment under the bed. Um, I'll show you our confetti. Mike might shout at me, but this is our confetti. It's um, biodegradable and it is pink. Uh, no, it's not. Why did I just say pink? It's white and gray. Like, why would I say pink? Obsessed, it's so pretty. Um, and I got this from Proper Confetti, London. This was off Etsy. I can't show you anything else as much as I'd like to because um, it will ruin it. It'll ruin it completely for like guests and stuff. We're having just a total sort out day. So if this is really boring, I do apologize. Done. So all I've got to do in this room now is Hoover. Woohoo. No. I've just caught this little guy. I can't remember his name, but I've just lost like nine balls trying to catch Chica Rita or something. I don't know. We downloaded, we re-downloaded Pokemon Go and the whole squad are Pokemon going. So this has become our nightly activity now. Good morning guys. It's a new day. I haven't filmed much this week. I'm feeling a bit shh. I'm feeling pretty low this week. I don't know why. Well, I do know why. There's a pandemic going on. Holiday was cancelled. Yeah, I'm just feeling a bit low, um, but I just wanted to talk about fingers. So basically, um, I think I've mentioned it a couple of times before. I have a really bad habit of biting my fingers. I know that it is now an OCD and I'm not the only one. I think quite a lot of people do it, but I think a lot of people rip the skin. I bite like I am full on cannibal of my own skin when I get stressed and I am in a lot of pain today because I do stupid things like this. Don't know if you can see, but I did that last night. I've tried things like, obviously when you're trying to stop yourself biting your nails, you put like, you dip your fingers into horrible tasting like chemicals. Like nail salons have just opened up in the UK, but I can't get my nails done because the state of my hands is like, nothing is gonna save them. So this is like the worst one that I did last night and I'm in a lot of pain with that now. Um, but like just all over like there I've bitten, there I've bitten, there I've bitten. My thumb I've kind of made a bit disfigured because I was biting the sides. And then on this hand it's the same with my thumb. Like Mike laughs at my thumbs because I just bite them and they look weird now. It's just like all over but. Yeah so if anyone else can relate then tell me because I don't know it's, it's not a nice thing. <laughs> Another week of filming a hundred princess videos. Got two to film as Belle. Um, oh, I need my gloves. Where art thou gloves? I've got two to film as Belle and one to film as Ariel, one to film as Moana, and I've just filmed four of Elsa. So it's a busy one, but gotta make sure you hit that poker stop. Gotta catch them all. That's all I need, and I'll be alright. Again. So how'd you do it? How'd you graduate so fast? It was my parents' dying wish before they asked. What? <laughs> Say <pass. laughs> Don't let them know what you're against or what you're for. You can't be serious. You wanna get ahead? Yes. Fools are on their mouths of wine up dead. Hey, yo, 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 what time is it? Showtime! Like I said. Showtime, showtime, yo!
I'm John Lawrence in the place to be Where two pints of Sam Adams now are working on three Hey all you cool cats and kittens <laughs> So it's another day The last couple of days have been weird Like really weird Like stressful so yeah the last couple of days have been really really busy and um, basically filming princess videos um and i've had a couple of adverts to shoot as well for like sponsorships and stuff like that but i just wanted to kind of box everything off before the weekend begins um i have a couple of things to do before we go out tonight with our friends but we're going for a pub meal with our friends tonight i don't know if i will be filming anything tonight um because i kind of just want to chill and enjoy the night and not have like a i don't want my mind to be running on youtube and work and things like that so I might see you tonight, might not see you tonight, but I wanted to check in, it's Friday today. Good morning everyone, we had a really nice night last night with our best friends and um, yeah, it was just nice to be out, it felt really normal. And today, I have a package. And I think I know what it is. So I ordered some Disney candles from the company Dole Wicks. <laughs> Ooh, I'm excited. So I got Mickey's ice cream. Do you want to smell? Yeah, come on now. Oh my lord, that is so nice. I mean, it's just chocolate, but it's so nice. So that's how it keeps packaging. Oof, it's intense that. I know, that's what you <laughs> want in a candle. You want intense. Then we got um, pineapple swirl. You're like, oh, that's intense as well. Dole whip. Dole whip. And then this one, I'm not really sure like what this will smell like. I don't like cinnamon, but I thought that I'd get rose gold churros, but I think they're gonna be cinnamon, so. That's amazing. That's amazing, but he's not gonna like that because he doesn't like like, um, like sweet and buttery. So this is rose gold churros. And look at the inside. Ooh. It's all glittery. As I say, I got these from Dolwick's Candle Company and you can find them on Instagram and Facebook and I will leave the links um, down below. Cute, I love the packaging. Hello, <laughs> just me again, just checking in. Um, I just wanted to say that I've been feeling really crap <laughs> the last two weeks and last night um, was just like wonderful and it did me so much good um i just feel like it was exactly what i needed and um so it was m one of my bridesmaids sophia that we went out with and her partner jack me and sophia were having the conversation last night that like the first few times you go out on like double dates it's kind of like the the men it's to them it's like a not a chore but it's like a duty to go out and socialize because the girls are best friends so the men have to like make sure they get on and all that um but i don't know what i'm talking about but basically we we're just saying that it's so nice because now um mike and jack have got like a genuine relationship themselves um and like just like a really nice friendship and i get on really really well with jack they're just like the loveliest couple it was just so lovely and um yeah i, I look forward to doing it again whenever the next time is we went for food in one place and then we went for drinks in another place and in both places we weren't near anyone else it was just us four kind of thing so um yeah it was just super duper nice now we are sat well i'm sat outside costa and i've made mike run in for it because it's raining he just went up there and then he just drove back down why so costa's here i think that you might actually be able to sit in now in, in our costa but um i know that mike was going to ask them so let's get the verdict thank you you all oh. oh nearly oh no hello are they sitting in yeah you you allowed to sit in there's tons of people in there do you want to go to costa later what have you got in a box like this mine was a bit of a bigger box oh, yeah because you've got two <laughs> so this one is what pineapple swirl Yep, yeah, have you got this? Yeah. Mm. Smells delightful. <laughs> Alright, we got it. <laughs> Wait, let me smell. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? Okay. Oh, I can't wait for this one. Coffee at the castle. Oh. Is it good? Yeah. Mm, but it smells strong. Michael likes it. I won't like it. <gasps> You'll like this one. We've not got this one. Oh, that, no, I like, actually, I, d I really like that, actually. I thought it's much stronger than that. Oh, no, I think that's strong. And where are they from? 
dull wicks. <laughs> we're having roast dinner for our tea tonight and we're having some beef and some chicken, some carrots, some Yorkshire puddings and some roasties. Um, Mike was like, roast dinner on a Saturday. But I just kind of feel like it's been a horrible day weather wise that I just kind of feel like I need some nurturing and a roast dinner will do the trick, I'm hoping. Um, I actually feel like it's winter, which is stupid. And I've lit our sugar frost Christmas Yankee candle because um, it just kind of feels like homely and, and you know when the weather's so bad it just makes you want to be snuggled in a blanket with like a nice, I don't know, cosy candle on um, and Christmas makes me happy so it's Christmas in July as they say. Right, um, we are in Chester and we're going for a shop. We're having a shop day. I've got, um, I've had a bit of like a migraine today, like eye wise. I get really bad eyes sometimes, but um, it turns into like a little bit of a headache. So I'm hoping my headache goes. Oh, I've got new shoes on. I just stood in a puddle. Do I see my new shoes? Oh, they're nice. Mike got me them for um, oh, like them. our anniversary. Family outing. <gasps> you touched the door. Oh, you touched the door. Yeah, I didn't. You look lovely today. I love the colour yellow, you know, I'm really... I think it suits me. Yeah, normally I wouldn't wear yellow, but I feel it's very happy and I'm coming around to it. We've come to Muffin Break, which is our favourite place for lunch, and um, we've got some cake and some toasties and some hot drinks. Um, it's quite quiet in here today, but I feel like Chester is quite busy, so I've bought quite a few things in Primark, but yeah, I'm trying not to spend too much money today. Who bought their wedding ring? <laughs> this chick. I'm trying not to spend too much money today. <laughs> Do you like my wedding ring? Yeah, it's nice for this. It's um it's a size too big. They only had one left in the store and it's a size too big, so they're resizing it. We've bought it, they're resizing it for me, and I think it'll be ready to pick up in like a month. But um it complements my engagement ring really, really nicely and um I'm just really excited to get the other ring now. It's like Eight eight months and a week or eight eight months ten days or something to go. 